Have you ever heard of microchip implants? These tiny devices, about the size of a grain of rice, can be implanted under your skin and used for a variety of purposes. From storing medical information to making payments, some people believe that microchip implants are the future of technology. But are they also a threat to privacy? In this video, we'll explore the potential benefits and risks of microchip implants. So join us as we delve into the fascinating and controversial world of microchip implants. Microchip implants are becoming increasingly common in the expanding digital world of wirelessly connected internet-enabled devices, known as the Internet of Things (IoT). However, experts are warning of potential security threats as hackers may target vulnerabilities in the sensors and network architecture of these devices, including microchip implants. These implants typically carry unique identification numbers and can be tagged with user data such as health records, social media profiles, and financial information. While RFID chips are passive transponders, meaning that they require digital readers to be positioned within a few inches of the user's hand to communicate, near-field communication NFC, chips use electromagnetic radio fields to wirelessly communicate with digital readers in close proximity, similar to how smartphones and contactless credit cards work. Biohacks, a leading provider of NFC chips, notes that one of the benefits of NFC is international use, as the standard is already widely supported by existing infrastructure and a variety of services and products in the public and private sectors. If you're someone who frequently misplaces essential items like keys, wallet, or bank cards, the idea of never having to worry about losing them again may seem like a far-fetched dream. However, a Russian doctor in Novosibirsk has taken this idea to the extreme by implanting tiny chips in his fingers and wrists to replace some of these items. By doing so, he now has a chip in his hand that functions as a key to the intercom system at the hospital where he works. Another chip serves as his work pass, and a third one functions as his ATM card. He has also implanted a chip in his wrist that can store contact details and transfer them to his mobile phone. Alexander Volchek said, In order to get to work, you need to take out your purse, take a card out of it, apply it, put it back, and not lose it. It is very important because my wife got her chip after she lost four cards. Instead of this, with a well-worked-out movement, just put your hand to the reader. You don't notice the infrastructure around you. It makes your life a lot easier. Although still enthusiastic about his own life choice, Volchek is not blind to the obstacles preventing chipped humans from becoming the norm. There are no other things in it apart from identification and getting some pleasure out of it, he explained. Medically implanted devices have not yet reached the level of miniaturization and the level of energy consumption that would be desired in order to be used in general practice. Microchip implants have the potential to revolutionize the industrial world in various ways. These tiny chips can be embedded in different devices to make them smarter and more connected. They can be used to track inventory, monitor equipment performance, and even enhance worker safety and productivity. One of the most significant advantages of microchip implants is their ability to improve access control and security. These chips can be used to grant access to secure areas, control machinery, and manage logistics, improving overall efficiency and safety in the workplace. Microchip implants can also streamline payment systems, making transactions faster and more secure. For instance, they can be used to replace credit and debit cards, eliminating the need for physical cards that can be lost or stolen. This technology would be particularly useful in the manufacturing industry, where workers need to purchase tools and supplies quickly and efficiently. In the medical industry, microchip implants can be used to store vital health information such as medical history and allergies, reducing the risk of medical errors and improving patient outcomes. These chips can also be used to monitor and track patient health, providing real-time data that can help doctors make informed decisions about treatment. Microchip implants offer numerous benefits, but as with most things in life, they also come with drawbacks. One of the primary concerns is privacy. As these implants contain personal information, they could be used to track an individual's every move, which could be a major violation of privacy. Additionally, these chips could be vulnerable to hacking, which would allow unauthorized access to personal information. Another concern is the ethical implications of microchip implants. 
While some people may view them as a way to enhance human capabilities, others may view them as an infringement on individual freedom and bodily autonomy. Additionally, there are health risks associated with the use of microchip implants, including the risk of infection or other complications from implantation. The involvement of governments in regulating microchip implants is crucial to ensure the responsible use of this technology, particularly with regard to privacy and security concerns. While these implants have the potential to revolutionize various aspects of modern life, it is important to carefully examine their potential risks and implications before deciding to use them. The government's role in regulating new technologies is to ensure that they are used safely and responsibly, while protecting the privacy and security of individuals. This is especially important with microchip implants, which can store and transmit personal information. Governments should establish regulations and laws to ensure that individuals have control over their data and that companies and organizations protect that data from unauthorized access and use. Currently, there are no specific regulations or laws that govern the use of microchip implants. However, existing laws related to privacy, data protection, and medical devices can still apply to the use of these implants. For example, in the United States, the Federal Trade Commission can regulate the use of microchip implants in the workplace under the Fair Credit Reporting Act and the Electronic Communications Privacy Act. There have also been proposals for new laws and regulations specifically related to microchip implants. These include laws that would require companies to obtain explicit consent from employees before implanting them with microchips, and laws that would regulate the collection, use, and sharing of data obtained from microchip implants. The use of microchip implants in the workplace and other settings raises important implications for privacy and security. It is crucial for governments to ensure that individuals have control over their data and that companies and organizations protect that data from unauthorized access and use. Microchip implants hold incredible potential for future technological advancements, and we are only beginning to scratch the surface of what is possible. With continued innovation and research, we could see these implants used for a wide range of applications, from enhancing cognitive function and memory to enabling seamless communication and collaboration in the workplace. The integration of AI and machine learning could take these implants to the next level, allowing them to adapt and learn as they collect data and potentially even predict and prevent health issues before they arise. As technology continues to advance and become more intertwined with our daily lives, microchip implants could become an increasingly common tool for enhancing and improving human capabilities. Of course, with great power comes great responsibility, and it will be essential to ensure that these technologies are developed and implemented in a way that prioritizes privacy, security, and ethical considerations. In conclusion, as we've explored in this video, microchip implants are a fascinating and rapidly advancing technology with the potential to revolutionize various aspects of modern life. It's just important to remember that the decision to get a microchip implant should not be taken lightly. Before deciding to get one, it's important to carefully consider the potential risks and implications, as well as the current and proposed regulations and laws. By staying informed and making informed decisions, we can ensure that this technology is used safely, responsibly, and for the greater good. That's it for today. Please leave your thoughts and comments in the section below. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell notifications so you don't miss any future videos. And click here if you want to see our video on smart tattoos.